What up, guys? Spider here. We get a uh, trophy guide for Beyond Two Souls. We're almost done with these guys. We've like two left after this. Anyways, this is for saved all, saved every character that could be saved, and a better world. Let every possible character die and chose to go with them to the info world. Anyway, there are four missions where you can let characters die or you can save them. The first is in Homeless. After Tuesday gave birth to her child, you're in this this new building and you're sleeping, you wake up and there's this big fire, okay? Uh, Stan and Tuesday will always survive. You can't really kill them up. The other two guys, I think it's, what is it, Jimmy and Eddie or something like that? The uh, the, the other two guys, the, the drug addict and, and the... Uh, the older dude there. Where are the others? Um, on this those floor, guys Jimmy. can be saved, and, and I'm Zoe actually going, going to show you how to save them. I mean, one of them is on, I think, the level that we're on, and uh, the other is is sort of upstairs. So if you don't want to save them, just don't go into this room. Like, we're going to go into this first room here. Um, yeah, we're going to go, yeah. He wants, he wants to be saved. Help, help. Okay, so just go up the stairs. Never mind trying to save them, all right? And we're going to use uh, Aiden to uh, to get the door open here. And come on, Aiden, let's go. Or we're going to kick it in ourselves, maybe. Maybe not. No, Aiden's going to do it. And hey, buddy. Okay, go. Go. Yes, I know you're upstairs, so get the hell out. Okay, so we saved him. Like I said, if you don't want to save him, just don't even do anything with the door. Don't switch to Aiden. Just go right upstairs, and we're going to go save Jimmy next. All right? Same goes for Jimmy. You do actually have to go into the room where Jimmy is in order to be able to save Tuesday. Um, again, you have to save Tuesday. She has to survive. The baby has to survive as does Stan. Um, but you go in, you talk to Jimmy, and you're going to talk and say, Jimmy, all you got to do is jump across, and you're saved. And he's like, oh, dude, I'm a drug addict, and I can't jump very far, and I'm not going to make it. Um, in this instance, we do possess him with Aiden, and we do force him to jump across over onto our side of the uh, the floor here. But again, if you don't want to save him, you want him to die. Depending on which trophy you're going to back, you know you're going back to get, then um, you just don't take him over, and he just ends up dying in the fire because he doesn't want to jump across. And it's not even that big of a jump, anyway, right? Um, so, no. for these trophies, I mean, no, you don't I have to replay the entire game. I mean, depending on I what happened at uh, Homeless, uh, if you saved them both, then you're good. Uh, if you <laughs> killed them both, then you're good. We'll you only have to replay from the next closest mission that uh, where, you know, whether you saved them or you killed them, uh, depending on what trophy you're going for, you can replay from there, make sure you save, and then finish the entire game until you get your trophy, all right? Yeah. So the second mission where you are able to save a character or let them die uh, is coming up here next. We just saved Jimmy. It's cool. It's cool. Uh, is in Navajo. Navajo, and I didn't even realize this was an option. And this is towards the um, the end of the mission where we figure out that the grandmother has the uh, the amulet that's needed. And she has that blanket that we had the vision about. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to let this scene play out here a little bit because we do end up linking up or mind melding, the Vulcan mind meld with the uh, the grandma here. And we see a vision, etc., so that we can save everybody. But Paul, Paul was hurt because the uh, the spirit came back to the house during the day and, and it, it attacked Paul. Paul is in his bedroom all right, he's bleeding out. When I first played this through, I didn't even realize it would have been an option to go in and try and save him, and you end up healing him with Aiden. But uh, here it is. We're going to go go through the vision, and you're going to see me saving him. If you don't want to save him, then just don't go into the bedroom. Just don't do anything. Just go back out and finish the rest of the mission, and uh, and he'll end up dying. But if you do want to save him, then just go back into the bedroom and switch to Aiden. And you have to, you have to do this vision because I did go in beforehand and I didn't have the option to switch to Aiden to save him. Uh, it only occurred after I had this vision in mind melded with the grandmother. So we'll let this, the rest of the scene play out and uh, you'll see me saving Paul. for the white man. The green spirit kill their enemies and gain revenge. Ah! Against them. 
He was still hungry. Hungry for blood. Yeah, Itsu is back. He has come to take our lives. We're your ancestors. They're the guardians who protect the house, right? They know they were wrong, so they returned to protect us from the evil that they released. If they brought the entity here, I mean, there's gotta be some way to send it back to its own world. They used a ritual to open the passage. I still remember the incantation, but the ritual is lost. I saw the ritual in my vision. I'll prepare it and you can help me with the incantation. Hurry! He's coming. All right, so that's uh, three out of uh, four, five, six characters that we can save or we can let die. Uh, the fourth here is Nora, and we just did our mind meld with Nora, but then it's like, well, are you sure you want to leave? You do have the opportunity to put Nora out of her misery, and when you know when when the the trophy says saved all, saved every character that could be saved. I mean, in my mind, actually killing her is saving her. But really, the trophy means you got to save her, meaning she has to be alive, okay? So just make sure we're clear about that. Saving Nora, <laughs> again, is making sure she's alive for the trophy perspective, but in my mind, saving her is actually putting her out of misery like we just did. Uh, if you do want to keep her alive, all you have to do is leave. Just pick the option to leave, and uh, you're good, and she stays alive, and you can get the trophy that way. Okay, the last uh, mission here is Black Sun. Now, there are two characters that can die in Black Sun. One is Cole. Cole here, he gets attacked by the entity, and you can either keep running. I mean, if you kept running towards Ryan, then Cole wouldn't survive. Um, in this case, we went running back towards Cole. We ended up picking him up and bringing him to safety here. Now, I do use I to heal him. I'm pretty sure I didn't confirm this. I didn't test this. But you want to make sure if you're going to save Cole, make sure you heal him here. Um, I'm pretty sure if you didn't heal him here, that he'd still die. Uh, but again, I haven't tested that. I did heal him uh, in order to get the trophy for saved all. Uh, when I didn't want him, like when I wanted him to die, I just didn't pick him up. I left him in with the entities. I didn't even go running back towards him. So that ensured that he was definitely dead. He's right. Come on, Jody.
All right, and our final character that can die is Ryan in The Black Sun. So we, we, we hook up with Nathan here, right? And there's a specific sequence that you have to talk to Nathan in uh, in order for him to be pissed off enough. You want him to shoot us. So you have to blame him here, blame him for what's going on, and then when you get the next option for dialogue, uh, be cold towards him. And that really pisses him off. That pisses off Nathan. And uh, he ends up wanting to shoot you and try to kill you. If you don't want to go down the path of Ryan dying, you want to save him, then just pick the other options, and Nathan will just let you go by. Um, and then you end up hooking up with Ryan again. But here, in this case, we're showing you the, the way to actually get Ryan killed. So Nathan's going to get pissed. We're going to try and walk by him. He's going to end up shooting us. We do have one more opportunity to save Ryan in that me, after Jody. he shoots Jody, you do have the opportunity to uh, switch to Aiden here and choke Nathan out no and kill him basically ourselves. But if no you wait too long, you'll see what happens and Ryan ends up uh, running up trying to be the hero. Whatever, Ryan. Ends uh, <laughs> up trying to be the hero and tries to take the gun from Nathan because Nathan, you know, it looks like Nathan wants to just kill Jody. Right? So he tries to grab the gun, Nathan ends up shooting him, and he shoots Nathan, and Jody's all upset because her boyfriend's dead. Whatever. Whatever. I don't care. He's dead. Yeah, you'll get over it, Jody. Trust me. Anyways, we're going to um, let the rest of the scene play out here, and uh, I also show a scene from when we're looking into the beyond, and it shows every possible character that can die. There is one character that has to die that we see in the beyond, that you cannot save, and that is the grandmother from Navajo. There is no, absolutely no way to save her. She dies, so don't worry about her uh, with respect to either of these trophies, all right? But just remember that the A Better World, the saved all, as soon as you're done the mission, no matter what you do after you know not killing Ryan here and you have every character that can be saved, it doesn't matter what you do at the end of the game, wait until the credits roll and you will get your trophy at the end. For the um, A Better World, you have to choose Beyond. Okay, and that's what we're gonna end up doing right here when we see the uh, sort of the beyond section here We're gonna end up uh, we'll look into the life and, and we'll select beyond and that's when you get your a better world trophy And that's what we end up getting at the end of the uh, of the uh, the video here. All right, so I'm gonna leave you guys uh, with that and hopefully It helps you out for both of those trophies and uh, one silver a better world is silver and saved all is a gold trophy I'm a spider and so I'm out. So many things I still have to do.